against uh, the Samus from Astrea. Uh, I wish that we could have seen that, honestly. That sounds like it was probably a really good set. But you know what? So far, Top 8's been nothing but 3 O's. Let's see if this match is going to go the distance, because I have a good feeling about it. I think that these players, the way that they have been executing tonight, that they are going to find themselves fairly evenly matched. And here we go, Inkling versus Ken. Players have a tendency to grab momentum quickly and run away with it. Cytonic's already tacking on 70%, but now he's on the other side of the string with that grab and another grab, more than enough to even out the percentages and put him into a dicey situation. 100% already. Cuckoo really tiling it on, and that up air critically can get through the focus attack being a multi hit. The pressure that he is layering on the ledge here is absurd. Can Cytonics make it back? That back air might seal it. Nope. Manages to get through and power through the offensive pressure with that true Shoryu taking the first stop. But at 154%, he's going to have to tread lightly if he wants to maintain any momentum. Cuckoo going for his almost signature inkling up smash. Fishing for that back air, trying to steal the stock. Now he finds himself at 80% and in a precarious position off the ledge. And his approach gets called out by yet another true Shoryu. Cytonic's playing dirty. Cuckoo finally manages to seal out that stock with the back air of the ledge, but now he has an entire stock deficit to make up. He cannot continue to struggle to kill like that if he wants to be taking these games. Very nice good use of the multi jab. Oh, misses the grab combo though, and he pays for it dearly as Cytonix takes that first game in demanding fashion. Sure, you wing is. Here we are, going back into it. Game two of the Loser's Quarterfinals in uh, this week's top eight, and we have the small battlefield counter pick coming out for Cuckoo. Cuckoo's already taken a fairly sizable percentage deficit, and he's in a bad position here. Oh, gets caught by the Tatsu going towards the stage. Has to be so careful with the approach so that that doesn't happen. Vitonic seems to just be able to wait for Cuckoo and nail him with those uh, true shore you helps the percentage is high enough. Gonna take some re strategizing from Cuckoo to break through that sort of defensive posture and manage to get the hits that he needs without being susceptible to those shore use. 
And Kent was made with the roller, but oh, the, even the late hit of the shore, you still managed to call him out. Titanic seems to be trying to bait and punish them, but to no avail so far. Sneaking in the back air. Oh, but he jumps over the down smash. Titan oh. Kuku managed to dodge one Shoryu, but it caught by another. He knew it was coming, but there was nothing that he could do about it. Up there, almost taking the stock there. Ken at 160, just refusing to die. And the rage making him all the more dangerous in this situation. Focus attack gets through back air. This could be it! Oh! I think we have a misinput that wasn't a true Shoryu that certainly would have ended the game. But there it is. A three stock from Cytonix in this game too. Cuckoo's back is against the wall here. His tournament life is on the line. And uh, that last game did not look good for him. Inkling struggling to kill head and hands. Cuckoo is a beast. It's true. Three, two, one, the chat go. believes in Cuckoo. Send him your energy. You can do so by subscribing to the One Life to Play Twitch channel. Cuckoo taking an early lead here. Oh! Goes for the roller, but gets caught out by the Shoryu. He just has to find an answer for that if he wants him to set. At this point, he's got to be getting tilted by the dozens of Shoryus he's taken. Titanic's matching his air drift almost perfectly in those interactions. So constantly threatened the raw Shoryu. Oh, not able to get the punish there, but is able to get out of that particular Shoryu. Very fortunate. He blinked in the face of the shield pressure, going for the grab, but missing and getting caught by the Shoryu snapping to the ledge. He's got to take this stock fast or he's going to lose momentum in a big way. Very nice back air, sneaking in over the... Uh, wow, Hadoken, thank you. I completely don't the word. Sneaking it over the Hadoken, taking the stock there. Oh, but unable to even up the percentage deficit before another Shoryu blows up his second stock. Kuku Kachu's tournament life is on the line this stock. It's do or die for the squid. Good use of the neutral B to apply the ink, get that bonus damage. Whoa! He's chasing for the Shoryu! Oh, that shield was just a blue Skittle! Up smash, not enough to take the KO yet. Very nice down tilt. He can take the stock here, he has a chance. He can't afford to be taking too many of these trades. Oh, he's not able to get the punish off the Shoryu with. Tattooing towards the stage, but he managed to slip past it. 
Doesn't get the sweet hit of the back air. The up smash whiz, he's stuck on the platform. Oh! That shield was too small! And that's gonna be Cytonics taking this set 3-0. Oh.